situation already but it seems like it's changing day by day what's what's the latest after this morning going into this afternoon well again you know guys are competing you know the the, the mantra doesn't change the guy that takes care of the football and the guy that leads our team is going to be our guy and, you know every day somebody's doing something good and going up and down the, you know the, the pecking order but you know right now there's, there's nothing being settled you know, we'll, we'll get through the next scrimmage and probably make some, some you know, closer decisions you know, you, you want this team to take the ball away. And, and from day one, since you took this job, that's been a high priority for you. Are, will we read too much into it if we say this defense that we've seen in camp is a team that's going to be taking the football away more? Well, I, I think we're playing with a different edge than we played the, you know, last year. Uh, when you have a bunch of young players, or even if they're not young, they're first-time players, typically don't have the confidence, they don't have the swagger to play. You know, it's first time being out there. So it's hard to play at the top of your game when you're questioning yourself, am I lined up right? You know, everything's happening so fast. You start feeling comfortable and you've seen progress from guys like, uh, you know, Jamal Ellis, um, you know, Dalen Jones, Stratton Brown, those guys are, are attacking the football. Malcolm, you know, Washington is back out here today. You know, Tank Kelly, you know, you're in our program. Those guys are attacking the football. Uh, and you expect that for guys to develop in your program. I, I think we're gonna be much closer to 30 plus takeaways this year. Uh, than we have been in the last two years. And, and, and we, our formula for winning, we've got to do that. We've got to take care of the ball in the offense, or we've got to force it.